Hi, my name is Lonnie. I'm the Clinical Aesthetic Practitioner at Fraser Medical Aesthetics in Vancouver, BC. And since April is Rosacea Awareness Month, I just wanted to take the opportunity to briefly explain rosacea and help make the symptoms recognizable. Many people have it and they don't actually realize that they do. So um, what is rosacea? It's an underlying skin condition that generally shows up um, in adults or 30 plus. It does affect all skin types. Um, and we know that 50% of those diagnosed, it's likely due to hereditary factors. <clears throat> so for the point of this video, I just wanted to quickly share um, A, the uh, different types of rosacea and also to talk to you about triggers and treatments. So there are four different types of rosacea and th these are things that you need to be conscious of. So type one is the redness, flushing, raised red patches, visible vessels, broken vessels on the cheeks um, and on the nose and on the chin. Type two is like the active acne that feels like it's got a sunburn behind it, pimples, pustules. Three is the enlarged nose with the enlarged pores. That can be a, a, an actual disfigurement if not treated. And then the fourth one is, is eye rosacea. So excessive dry eyes, tearing, swollen eyelids, lash loss, vision loss, all those things for any length of time need to be checked out by a doctor to find out if you do have rosacea. So if you do have rosacea, it's very important to know that there is no cure, but there is ways to, to mitigate those, um, the, the triggers and to also be able to treat um, the skin and take care of the skin. So triggers are the lifestyle driven, things like spicy foods, perfumes on your body, on your clothes, um, sometimes in, in the skin uh, products that you buy over the counter. Uh, it's really important if it's not it medicinally driven, then it's likely not, to, it's, it's likely irritating your skin. So getting a great skincare program is super important. Um, knowing what your triggers are, the stress related, heat related, all of those things, making a note of it and then taking care of yourself. Next thing um, that you need to do is make sure that you're treating your skin. So there are skin treatments to help with the symptoms and IPL is great for vessels and uh, for pigmentation and chemical peels are wonderful for, for helping with the pH and the irritation and uh, helping control uh, water loss. So another thing that we need to add is a skin care, <clears throat> excuse me, skin care plan. So day-to-day -day skin care, make sure that you're taking care of your skin. Illumier has a calming collection that is specifically for rosacea. Um, there's Rosatrol, which is the ZN Obagi or ZO. Um, that's a one-stop shop treatment if you do not have something from your dermatologist, which I recommend getting. Um, and then there's other things that you can do to support your skin health, your hair health, joint health, and that's by taking an oral uh, collagen. And this one is the True Marine Collagen, we carry this. So these are just some things that you need to, to A, understand uh, when to get the diagnosis and to take care of yourself and, and understanding your triggers and understanding what treatments are available and how very important this skin care is to taking care of and managing your rosacea. And I hope those factors were helpful for you and I look forward to seeing you all again.